Uh, Romello White had a double-double, and number 20, ASU, goes to 7-0 on the season for the first time since 1980. They defeat the Don, 75-57. Ben Ron, J.B. Long, Cody Justice got the scoring started for the Sun Devils early. Well, the improved Cody Justice, he's added dimensions of his, to his game, J.B. He's knocking down shots, but in addition, he's getting to the rim. He really has the pull-up game. He's able to beat guys off the bounce and get to the rim and finish. He's really become a versatile player. His, his statistics have gone up every year he's played within this program. Uh, even though it wasn't the hottest three-point shooting night, it seemed like the Sun Devils made a concerted effort to get points in the paint, and White led the way. Ben, why not? If you had a player like Romello White, you're going to go at him every chance you get. He's going to be there to defend you at the rim. He's going to be there to help your team get going in transition, but he'll get opposite. He just told us that in his interview. He will get to the rim and try to score. He really prides himself of being a, of being a game time player around the basket. So it's a 75-57 win over the Dons. Trey Holder, the two-time reigning Pac-12 Player of the Week, had a light night in terms of scoring, but still a productive one. And again, the Sun Devils, 7-0 for the first time since 1980.